Hey guys, and welcome back to Factorio Massa with me, Sijo, and Avak Bentham and Arumba. And this glorious creation. It's getting there, so... It looks pretty. I don't care if it works or not. So we've got the, like, that's the, the regular 4x4 is that. Then the addition to get it up to an 8x8, you stick another 4x4 beside it. And then you add in the 8x8 upgrade at the end. Mm -hmm. And then that makes it an 8x8. And then to get a 16 by 16 you take the 8x8 and stick it to the side of it. And then you add the upgrade, which I'm currently making just now. This is fantastic. It just looks I was seeing so this pretty. earlier. Just like 64 belt balances and crazy things. Maybe one day we will have need of such a thing. And this factory will be a success. I fear that day. I do not. I fear what we will have become. <laughs> what terrible sins will we have committed to wield such power? Glorious. We'll have automated the automation of the automation to have enough throughput for that. Sounds, sounds good. Yeah, I, 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 I see no downsides to this, frankly. No downsides. Not, not even one. Right. Um... Given that basically all in terms of the smelter, everything is going to be running on two, two, two belts um, all the way through the, the smelter. So, for example, over here, it'll all be running in one direction. Over here, it should be running in the same direction. Uh, that is the opposite direction from the other side. So something like along these lines. Um, well, does it need to be going in the opposite direction here? Yeah, because the way it works is it snakes. The ore or whatever goes down and then up and then down and then up. Well, could you not just have it, seeing as you, because you, you're having um, four different pairs of belts outputting anyway, you could mm -hmm. just have, just put a furnace column in between each of the, the ones? No, no, no. What happens is when these are out, um, uh, out these all get like merged together again or something. Yeah, basically, they all get merged together back onto two lines. That way, the um, output chest where the end product ends up, so the the iron plate, the I, the steel, the brick, um, and the copper plate, based on their fullness, it'll re it'll release or restrict or onto this main mixing belt. And that'll just all flow down, and it'll be merged onto just two belts, and then those two belts will snake through this melter setup. It ends up being able to... Limiting it to two belts worth of Based items. on the time that the smelters take... Now, this is the thing, is that in, I've never um, used uh, beacons on my smelting. Now, what? if we massively How long have you... Up, Whoa! Well, How long have you played Factorio and you don't use? Be I'm I'm amazed to hear. You I say just that. increase the amount of smelters. But you can get so much more with beacons. I've got infinite. I've got infinite room on my map. I don't need yeah. to make space efficiency. All well, for that. Space efficiency. All for that matter. That. The only thing that I'd put, if I was to beacon them, it would be for energy efficiency. Wouldn't really? bother with speed. Wouldn't bother with prod production because whoa, 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 whoa. Does does it that's backwards. Energy no. efficiency. Why? You just, you just said that you have infinite space, so it, why would you ever do energy if you could just place down more solar? Well, the energy means that I am i don't need to, because I don't tend to move to solar, I just use steam. It just means I need to use less steam, produce less pollution. Okay, but if you use beacon smelting, you need less steam, less pollution, because you get more productivity out of the steam that you not use. Not really. Yes, it, it really. No, no, no. no, no, no. I mean, it, the, the, uh, what, what's the ratio? To energy efficiency versus product productivity. For, I don't have the information off the top of my head, but I can guarantee you the comment section below is going to find links for you. There, there is oh, no so I'm, argument. I'm, I'm, I wasn't whatsoever. arguing with you. I was, I was literally just asking you a question. Stop being oh, so not, combative. You're used to Steejo. I'm, I'm not, not trying to I'm trap not, you. I'm, <laughs> not, I'm, saying, I'm not trying to be combative. I'm just saying, like, like there will be a wealth of knowledge talking about how how much more efficient it is. Like a single piece of ore using beacon smelting can become like. Ten times as much stuff. 
versus if you just use but, regular processing. But why? When I can just make a new outpost on a new ore patch and bring in more ore. Because then you can make one tenth as many outposts and spend more time building. But what if I like making the outposts? Well, then you go build an outpost right now. I need more iron ore. Go. <laughs> We've got more iron ore than we know what to do with because your <laughs> carrot beacon smelting is crippling us for power. Yeah, well, I'm almost Yeah, I, well, I, why don't you to... make the power to run your beacon smelting before running your mouth about the efficiency of anything? I told Use you I wasn't going to work on power. First. Well, then, then it doesn't out. matter, does it? Your beacon smelting is pointless because you can't power it. Because no one else is. Such is life. There's no is both of the cars here are built by me. <laughs> yeah. That's right. That's because oh, no I one else breaks them down and sticks them in their pocket. And then turned up in the other one as well. That's what happened. It's not unusual that you can arrive in the same place twice Actually, without leaving you it. Have you blueprinted this, by the way, Bantham? Uh, blueprinted what? Your setup over here. The the built balanceiness, or uh, what no, do you no, mean no, the no, furnaces? The furnaces. I have not. Okay, let me just uh, compact it down. Um... Oh, this is melting my brain. Oh, poop. I didn't mean to break down those beacons. Uh, I think I had it there, didn't you? If we take these out... If you want, like, the, 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 the unit of... of it, then you'd, you'd remove these two beacons at the top here as well, because then... because they uh... match these ones at the bottom. Yeah, but you can just overlap them. Yeah, but that will. I was just trying to make like the the minimal unit. The minimal unit. That's fine. Um, what would you need power? Doesn't matter that though? much. Oh yeah, I forgot. Oh no, the, the, well there is power. That's the substations. Oh crap. So we take the rid of the ones at the tops. We're leaving. Oh yeah, actually you're, you're quite right. That one substation will just repeat. Oh, we still need. Yeah. Uh, these. Okay. Right, if you grab a... Well, actually, I'll I best grab one as well. I've actually run out of underground belts. Uh, I actually don't have enough to give you, I'm afraid. Right, I'll just run back. Thank you. It's, uh, uh, blue underground belts have a few. Oh, sorry, I'll just run back and get some more. Now we can get rid. Pomp. I'm requesting, like, 40. Also, I've ended up with an odd number again. Please tell oh, me no. you've got an odd number, back. I've got 19. Yes. Yes. All is good. There's one. Oh, okay. I'll take yours. Yoink. There we are. Perfect. Uh, right. We need to bring along... I'm just going to go get myself power. a power suit. Okay. Through some roundabout means. It'll probably involve journeying out into the wilderness. Theft. Why did you not have a power suit? He died. Oh, so he did. <laughs> For all Beth. <laughs> I died protecting my work. You did. You you died proving proving me uh, wrong. By the way, did did we ever end up getting that uh, gate set up for trains? Yeah. Where is that built? I want to take a peek at that. Uh, up power. Down beside power. There we go. Okay. Right. We now have a sixteen belt balancer. Hooray! Hmm. I don't think we have stone brick connected up to anything. Possibly not even being smelted at the moment. Yeah, probably. Pretty much all smelting got shut down as we switched, made the this transition to. Not... Oh, there is Can't some. Tidy, is it? But we have a single stone miner left. Yeah, I don't think we've made a single stone outpost, have we? No. Nope. Because you don't normally need stone. I'm going to I'm going to mine the remains of this stone deposit a little bit quicker. Depends on um for a short term solution that will cause long term problems. Excellent. Depends on how big we want to make the factory, really. I imagine we, we're gonna get to a point where we just flat out need more stone apples? Stone, yeah, yeah. Sure. I think we're already there. I mean we can't survive off the initial stone. Which is a hundred underground blue underground belts to make.
such a wealth of equipment. All these productivity threes that I'm picking up right now. I'm so excited. So, joking aside, um, I really would be interested on the efficiency of um, versus the power use for productivity modules. I will confess I that I have um, operated under the assumption that it's generally not worth it for a very long I, time. So I, I really genuinely appreciate that. I, I would agree with you that it's not worth it in the early game, for sure. But once you get to productivity threes, that, that is the break point. So yeah. I usually skip productivity ones and twos and speed ones and twos. Yeah, I've, but, I've definitely heard you say that before. Uh, this is going to be fun. Oh, oh dear. Any chance that I'm robot Bentham at the moment? No, no you're fine. You're fine. Sound okay. I I seemed... The game has slightly leave, been leaving me behind. Uh, I can't actually do things now because it's busy trying to catch up, I think. Yeah, I think I'd prefer to make this across. This is again too, too complex for you. Apparently so. You seem to be running there. okay earlier, but now it's suddenly it's like, nope, you can't press buttons. Well, that's just frankly Rude. frustrating. Oh my god. Fucking tank stealing all my shit. FPS <laughs> is uh, 6. Oh, now it's 7. Mark the oh, improvement. Now it's, it's fine again. It's suddenly fine. Hooray! By fine, I mean, like, less than 30. That's fine. Okay. But now all seems good in the world again. No idea what happened. Did someone build something really big and complicated all of a sudden? Yeah. No. Oh. Did you? Yeah. Ah, well, well we I didn't there. build it, but I'm deconstructing stuff. I didn't notice any... The FPF drop on my end. I would have imagined that would have no. been reflected to everyone. I don't know what sounds like. Your, your, your PC is better. Well, no, because... Oh, wait, no, Arumba's not the host anymore. I, I honestly don't know. I really don't know, then. All right, there's lots of things that I need right now. Uh, base. Why... Why you not have lots of stuff in me? Tank Chan. Why am I? We need to go. Why am I the only one who puts lights anywhere? Hello, Steejo. Because hey, because you gave us this mod that means we have like infinite light. Yeah, but yeah. They look so. Green they torches. Look, they look so pretty. Military green torches. <laughs> yeah, I actually tried playing a complete pure vanilla for a second because I was testing just one mod and I forgot how dark the game gets so yeah. early. Like, within the first couple of minutes, it's like nighttime, and you're just like, oh god. <laughs> yeah, so I can blind. see literally nothing. Where did the sun go? Where's the moon? Where's the stars? Oh, ah! See, Joe, I, how do I fix Farl again? Just open up one spot. I hate this stupid Farl. I want to park. Can we park Farl somewhere else? <laughs> should we, or just should we, let's just make a Farl station. And from now on, Farl is not allowed anywhere but in Farl station. Well, there is a file station. The thing. Yeah, yeah there's there a, a file station away from everything else station, though. I feel that, that would be the, the, the optimum solution. What have you done to file? Just I like, think, as... I, I don't think I'm doing it right. <laughs> oh. Well, file is like, ah, stage your, I don't know stage your help! I'm being touched inappropriately robots. by a Roomba. Make much. the robots not be stupid, please. <laughs> <laughs> just like, if you're deconstructing anything near the train station, just send Farl away to something else. That's too much work. Is it more work than having to fucking empty out the things? <laughs> Not when I can just ask you to do it. Oh, oh my, god. my god. You lazy shit. You know, I can see why why the whole Steejo and, and Arumba Oops. is kind of like this abusive comedic relationship. My Nobody noticed the power... Shutting <laughs> off for any oil stuff, did they? Didn't well, really I was just working, and I probably did it. Sorry. Oh, Doesn't it was matter. me that did it. <laughs> oh, good. Thought it wasn't me. 
So See, yeah, I've made the while. joke many times before, and I'll continue to make it almost every time I play with Sejo. And that is that you know, I don't need a fully automatic, fully automated rail layer. I have a Sejo. That is his job. That's why he's he's that's like why, a mod. That's why you bring him along. He's my fully automated rail layer. Oh, must be nice to to feel that you've got a, a purpose in life, Sejo. Yeah, tell me about that. You can call him a Fars. Oh, you're How rude. Fucking rude. This is just an acronym. What are you talking about? A rude one. I didn't <laughs> say Fars, I said Fars. It's like Tars from no. Interstellar or whatever. Just a word. <laughs> Fars coming up for you, Bentham. <laughs> you want? Uh... File just went up via Avax little area there. It was coming to squishy again. Oh, they, was it was it File that did it in the first place? Probably. You've made it. Was enemy. acting on your orders. I, I it, genuinely thought he'd called it up to the station just to be lazy. No. I, I completely accepted it when you said no, no, that wasn't me. But that was the, immediately my first thought. It was like, Steve, Joe, really? You lazy bum, you just got Bentham killed. But no, no. Val well, seemed even... to decide to do it on its own. It just doesn't like it. Well, it was just like, yes, this is the superior path to take. Yeah, it doesn't actually go anywhere, but I want to be here. Right now. Well, it was actually just turning around. But... Uh, right, okay. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. We should probably make a separate turning point for it to turn around in. That doesn't involve squishing Bentham. In, in, say, a loop form. No. Do it, Bentham. I noticed that a ridiculous amount of these chests is just coal. We have a lot of coal. Mm. Oh, wow, yeah. We had no coal for a bit, so I fixed it. Yeah, now we're up to 469,000. And there's crazy amounts of solid fuel as well. Yes, yeah, 70k solid fuel. And I guess we'll be sorted when we start copper. making... Oh my lord. We'll be fine when we start making the uh, the rocket fuel then. You know what, I'm, I'm, I'm going to add to this. Do you ever start making something and you're like, this is going to take me so fucking long? Yeah. <laughs> Quite frequently, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go, robots. I'm giving you new places to put things. It's going to be grand. I forget. How do you make a lamp a specific color? Um, send a color, send it a color signal. Just like green signal will make it green? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's exactly it. And if you want to do um, funky things, like, for example, a lamp will always show the color signal, which has the highest numerical value. So okay, you can send it multiple signals, and it'll display whichever one has got the higher value at the time. Can I make a, a lamp a color always? Whenever it's on, it's just always that color, not based yeah. on a specific condition? Um, it always has to come from a signal, but you can just use a constant combinator. That's a lot of work. That's how you make colored lamps, unfortunately. Constant combinator? Aww. Yeah. That's easy, Fine. I can do that. Oh god, now I have to do it, otherwise I'll never hear the end of it. Oh. <laughs> Poor Rumba. Why are you wanting a light? Oh, I just want to have a light that just, I don't know, I want a visual indicator, because these this this area is a little dangerous. Don't mess with the power lines, they can't get connected. I had to manually disconnect the different la layers. I wanted the beacons to overlap both both sets of uh, smelters, because I you know, want to get them, make mm -hmm. them efficient. But at the same yeah. time, I don't want... They don't cross. You'll notice that the, all the electric poles connecting. Yeah, yeah, are I, see, I see what you're sequestered. saying. Mm -hmm. So I want a visual indicator outside of the machines are on, to indicate which column is running. Okay. You've done belted steel. That's, but that's cool. it. Yeah, that's, because I figured yeah, you the, build the rest steel of throughput, it. the steel throughput would be fine on a belt, but the other throughput would be too high. That's fine though. Whatever, Sticho, do what you want. <gasps> if you just have it so that it. Uh, he I don't know if you don't. Just gave you permission. Mm-hmm. Right. Here you can you just go. have it so that somewhere in the middle uh, the it it go like the two different sides are filled. 
What are you going to? Because I'm already bringing over many, many belts to run the the plates along, so that we stop using so many blooming bots. See, I no, the bots are not doing anything up here aside from moving steel. That's it. They're they're picking up the output. I could the try moment, to build yeah, it. The outputs f f like Fine, for everything but steel is going into. Uh... Okay, fine. Let's switch over to a belt to set up. Let's see how well the belts can handle this throughput here. You did make one with uh, the blueprint. Yeah, I'll, Let's I'll try, try it. it out for the the top one, but uh, that'll have to be in the next episode. Uh huh. Yeah. So, we should send the belt back and load it up near the station. I agree. If it'll so, if it'll handle it. Yeah. Go ahead. Anyway, as always, thanks all for watching. I've been Stu. You've been awesome. We'll see you next time. Bye, -bye. Okay, everyone. Bye. -bye. See you soon.